Adam, under 21s friendly with uh, Brighton, uh, run, run out 3 1 winners, a really pleasing result. Yeah, it's just a shame it's not in the league. Um, yeah, it's, it's uh, you know, Brighton obviously being a championship club and all, uh, we'll have some great youngsters and uh, it's good to see, see our youngsters uh, coming up above them. So, uh, you know, I thought everyone put a great shift in today and, and, you know, it's mainly for fitness in these kind of games, especially the friendlies. And I think everyone's put a, a really good shift in today. You played 60 minutes today and got yourself a goal, a bit of a perla from the edge of the area, a volley. Um, I suppose it must be a bit of a perla. Or? A bit of a perla. Oh, a perla. <laughs> but the manager did say that your hair made you look like, you look like Andrea well, Perlo as well. well so, I do but... get called that a lot, you know. <laughs> I'm only joking. Um, yeah, it was a, uh, you know, I, just, I knew straight away I was going to hit it, and I did. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's a great, role, great result for, for the for the team, and to get a goal as well um, is even better for myself. Uh, so hopefully we, the, the young lads can keep it going. There's been quite a marked similarity between the way the first team were playing and the way the, that performance in the 21s have just put in. As a manager, kind of underlying the importance of kind of mirroring that style of play in the 21s. Ab yeah, absolutely. I mean, the, the team that played today, we, you know, the, the training, we all trained together. And every, the great thing about this club and the way that the manager's done things is that every single player knows their role, uh, what to do out of possession, what to do in possession. Um, and that's even gone straight from, from to the first team all the way to the youth team, which is which is brilliant. So, if you were a youth team player and you, you were to come up to the youth, uh, to the first team, you know exactly what you're going to do, and I, I think that's brilliant for uh, for the club. Um, and as you watch a first team game in a 21 game, you won't see anything different because everyone knows what they're doing. In terms of the performance today as well, they look really like you're enjoying your football out there today. Was that the case? Yeah, I mean, uh, the gaffer wants us to get on it. Uh, just keep playing, keep playing, make things happen. Um, and we've got, you know, the team's full of players who can do that. Um, and it's just, you know, it's really enjoyable to play. In, and when you're enjoying football, you, you always play to your best standard. I suppose as well, with the way the first team play at the moment, competition for places is really high. But that performance from yourself kind of done you any harm in terms of trying to stake your place for a claim in the first Absolutely, team? Absolutely, yeah. I mean, when you're not playing, that's all you can do. You just, you know, go out and give it your best. Um, you know, like, like the gaffer says every day, your know, football can change within, within days. But... You know, it's good to see the first team doing really well. You know, the players who are starting, and and hopefully it ke keeps like that. And you know, it's great that we've got competition for places. When you scored your goal as well, you were, you were coming back saying, "Fozzy, I told you so." In reference to the first team coach Ian Foster, what was all that about? Yeah, well, yeah, we we got our uh, set players, and I was on the edge of the box, and I said to Fozzy, I said, uh, "Any chance of just swinging it to the edge of the box so I can have a volley?" He went, like, "Nah, no chance. Not not in the game. Not in the game." I was like, "Fair enough." And I've just gone and done it, so I was telling Fozzie, there you go, you know, maybe next time you can consider it. <laughs> and then with a lot of the lads that are uh, playing today as well, they're going to be on the on the bench or certainly travelling to the uh, to the Gillingham game at the, at, the, at the weekend. I suppose that will give them a bit of extra confidence in case they're called upon at the weekend. Yeah, definitely. I mean, the, the whole team throughout, you know, is full of confidence at the moment, um, which is a great feeling for, for the whole club and even the staff and everything. So, you know, the young lads, they know exactly what they're going to do if they get called upon. Um, and I'm sure that game is going to put more confidence on them.